Hey guys, back on today with a new video to show you how to add the plugin My Random Game Boot version 2 to your PSP. This is just a plugin, as I said, so it's like adding any other plugin. You can watch my video how to add plugins if you want. Don't have to watch this one. Um, but today I'm going to show you how to add this plugin to your PSP so you can have random game boots like my videos. So what you need to do is go to your PSP, plug it into USB mode, and that is if you have already downloaded the plugin. If you haven't downloaded it, pause the video download it now. Make sure you have WinRare to extract the file. Alright, my PSP has popped up. I'm going to open to view folders. So now you can see I have one window here with my PSP, one window with my plugin. So the easiest way for me to do it is go to SC plugins file on the memory stick. So here we have SC plugins folder. These are all the plugins I have, text files here. If you don't have a VSH text, you can create one. Pops text, you can create that yourself. You can create this yourself. And this one is used for recovery. You don't have to have it. And as you can see, my random game boot PRX file goes right here in the SC plugins folder. Now that file, you can find it inside the rare file of the plugin that you download. So extract it. Here we have it. So open, you see it has an SE plugins folder. If you don't have an SE plugins folder, you can drag and drop this onto the root of your memory stick. If you have an SE plugins folder, double click, drag and drop or copy and paste this in your SE plugins folder. I already have mine as you saw, so I'm not going to do it. So you copy, paste, drag and drop, whatever you need to do. Make sure that, as I said, is on the root of the SE plugins folder. So it would look like this, just like mine. And then once you have that on there, go into the VSH that you either have already or that you created. Just shrink this down a bit here. So you can see right down at the bottom there. Now you can see exactly what it says here. Right there. This is what you need in your VSH text file on your PSP. I'm going to copy it right now so that I can paste it in the description beside the link for you and it will be there waiting. Copy and paste that into the text file, the VSH text file that's in the SE plugins folder on your PSP. So now that you have this copied and pasted in your VSH text, you have my random game boot .prx file in the SE plugins folder
once you have both of those in and on your PSP, we can exit USB mode. I'm going to bring the camera down to the PSP now. So now that we're back on the PSP, and we've just added a plug-in to our PSP, so you want to turn your PSP all the way off by holding the off button until it turns off. Hold the R switch, R trigger, turn PSP on so it's in custom firmware recovery menu. Go down until you see the plugins. As you can see right there, plugins, that's what we added. And then we continue down. You see my random game boot. And you can see mine already says they're enabled. So make sure yours says that as well. Once you have it enabled, go to back, go down to exit. PSP reboots. Alright, PSP rebooted there. We go back over USB mode. Okay, guys, back on USB mode. Back on the computer. I'm going to open up my PSP memory stick here, go into the PSP theme file, and whenever you find a game boot for your PSP, you don't have to flash zero it now. You take that game boot and you make it look like this. So as you can see, I have 18 game boots. Just going to rename this one right now so it looks exactly the same. There we go. I've got 18 game boots. Make sure yours are numbered 1 to 20. And as many as you have, you can keep one. And it will also randomly play the game boot that comes on the CTF that you have loaded. And there you go. That's how you add my random game boot plugin and the plug the game boots themselves right onto the CTF theme file on the PSP. So right where it says theme on your PSP. This goes right in there. And you hopefully have seen my other videos on my random game boots. I have some for download. You can follow the links to those. And that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Make sure you comment, rate, and subscribe. Talk to you guys later. Peace.